Welcome to Falcon Extreme guys, today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on how to put shadings on your pictures and your font in GIMP. First of all we'll start off with your picture. Um, I've got my picture up here uh, beforehand and what you want to do now is you click on the picture which is an evil wizard um, go up to filters, click on filters, we scroll down to light and shadow, go across to drop shadow, left click on it and this little menu in your tabs down at the bottom will appear, you have to click on it to bring the menu up. Now you want to change the offset and the offset Y. You can keep it at 4, it'll still work, but I like to put a little bit more into it just to make it more effective. And I like to extend the blur radius a little bit more also. Click OK. And as you can see, there is now shading around my picture. Uh, the same will go for word fonts. So, Hogan Extreme. Just put that in there. Make it a little bit bigger. 130. We go and now if we go filters lights and shadow drop shadow and this one I'll just keep oh it's automatically saved in the same so I'll keep it the same and there is the shading and um, another little tip that you can do uh, if you want to put lighting into it now it's the same sort of feature so we click on uh, we're gonna click on my word here There we go. And I'm going to go to filters, lights and shadow, lighting effect. Click on that, this little menu comes up. Now, what you want to do is click this little blip, move it about wherever you want the light shining from, increase the lighting effect. Put it again near yeah, the yeah, X there, I want it like that. Click OK, and voila, you now have a lighting effect on your word on. Um, I hope this tutorial helped, if it did then please leave a like and comments below are really appreciated. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video and I'll see you later.